Hello, this is Lewis Ludlow speaking. I just want to say something interesting about a crow in Japan. I actually found out. I think it was Japan or China. And what a crow does, um, he had an, it had a nut in its own beak. What it did was, it went on something and dropped it in the road. Wait and then waited for the cars to all run it over, and then it cracked. And then when the traffic lights tell the um tell the vehicles to stop, they, the crow eats the nut the nut then when it's cracked open not the shell just the nut and then it flies off that's really clever but the difference between that and the scribble scribbles may be smart but actually a crow is actually quite smart when it does that to nuts in the room as well that is definitely a smart thing to do actually because think about it i'd have done that if i was a crow if i needed a nut but what do you think when people call call you know birds bird brains that yeah but actually it's not that they're talking about because actually crows are quite clever when they drop nuts in the road think about it though they're not like, i know monkeys are smart too but i mean birds are still smart enough to do that come on of course that's a smart thing for a bird actually that they're not at dumb every time so we still need birds so don't risk they don't risk always saying they're dumb because sometimes we do um actually find some things interesting do you like them. chicken chicken i do like the food of it but i mean would you ever eat a pigeon I don't know, maybe. But it doesn't <gasps> make cherry. You can still like birds if you eat them. Oh, no. You can still no. like birds if you eat them. You Kerry, would eat a pigeon. You would eat stop a pigeon. Stop the damn video. <gasps> Kerry, stop the video now. 